Is it crooked? No. Okay. Oh, what the fuck is? Oh, was that you? <laughs> oh. You sick. shouldn't have hugged me. This literally happened to like once I was crying and I hugged Scott, my mailman. Isn't he cute? Um. Yeah. Here comes the money. Here we go. Money talk. But let me do the intro. Hey guys, we're back. Guess who's back? Back, back, back again. By the way, this new mic I got. It's like so good in the car now. Since it's like an enclosed space. Like it could rain and you wouldn't probably hear it. It could rain, really? You wouldn't hear it? I mean, you'd hear it a little bit, but like it's much better. <laughs> we have fine. a dog right now, but we don't know if we're keeping it. Bitch! <laughs> a right. friend of my aunt, so my okay. mom's sister's friend, has a, has a lot of dogs, apparently. Right. No shade, no tea. They don't treat them that well either. <laughs> They literally were like, we're gonna let your dog sit for a week while like we go on vacation to Florida. And we were like sick. And they were like, yeah, we don't really know if we want it back though. How old's the dog? A year. Oh, that's a puppy. It's a year too late in the game to change its name though. Yeah. Okay. I mean, what's the name though? Libby. You know what? Maybe there's an exception. I stayed up really late last night because I have anxiety. Um, and then, I, why would you go, like who told you to take a look? I don't know, man. Absolutely. You weren't giving me directions and I just wanted to go where I wanted to go. If I don't say anything, it means keep doing what you're doing. All right, sorry. My mom was supposed to get me up because I set alarms and I just can't, my body doesn't wake me up. Like, if I hear the alarm and stop staring at those I was people. trying to figure out if he was wearing camo or if it was mud on him and it was really screwing me, sorry. It was really screwing me up. My mom has to like get me up like after I set alarms because like I'll sleep through my alarms. I used to do that too and then I got the watch and then I'm worst mistake I ever made. I let the watch buzz to wake me oh, up and I was in a dream where there was a bomb on my wrist. I, I just, I don't like magic it. Is hot. That's a fun fact about me. You guys oh ever God. seen Now You See Me? I love that movie. <laughs> but, Most attractive movie I've ever seen. But it's, I mean, it's because it's what, Dave Franco? But I think- I, I mean, think if they could be doing general. anything besides close-up magic, and I would still be like, this is great. I mean, I don't think it was the close-up magic. Was... ran out of uh, the venti cups. Oh, okay, the... thanks. Can it sauce me a little? <laughs> <laughs> really? Could you imagine he was like, we ran out of venti cups? I was like, go f***ing find one. <laughs> He's like, we Sorry. actually did fill it to the top, I just got thirsty. <laughs> Wait, so you are talking about him? Yeah, is we can it, talk Is this about allowed? Him. Are we allowed to say that he's your boyfriend or just some yeah. fling? Then that's what's new. Since the last time I've been on your channel, I got a haircut. I'm blonder. I went to New York. Young Kid Jungle, wet drinks made. Oh. I am. I'm not sadder, actually. I'm a little bit better mentally. And I have a friend. She has a boyfriend. Mm hmm. I'm gonna jump out and speed up. I'm gonna jump out. <laughs> You're gonna be the best man at our wedding. <laughs> Good. I better be. I feel like you're gonna get married first, and I'm gonna be there single, and then I'm. I, I have a feeling <gasps> I'm gonna, gonna go with one of the, the bridesmaids. Your life at my wedding. Yeah. Well, That's I mean, let's pull back on the reins. I didn't go that far. Here's the thing: down. my bridesmaids are all gonna be people that you already know. Oh, so you know what? Actually, I completely take back everything I ever said. I broke up with you because you wanted to hold my hand. Yeah, holding hands was too far. This is a lot, really fast. Yeah, now you're dating musicians from another continent, so times have moved. <laughs> times have moved pretty fast. Like, like it's not that far, okay? Just an ocean away. Again, speed up, I'm gonna jump. Okay. She's gonna go. It's I was bad. waiting until the railing was gone, so you had a good shot. Is that supposed to be a party trick? Who is a party trick? I do. It's not a party trick. Crying in the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> I do cry literally every time I go out. You could look at Anthony and I's text. It's literally him being like, are you out right now? And me being like, I'm leaving. I can't be here. I'm going home. Like, I'm calling an Uber. I need to leave. It's either that or you're trying to break up a fight in the parking lot. Oh my f***ing God. That makes it sound like I'm one of the girls though that like grabs people's shoulders. And they, look at me. It's <laughs> me. This isn't you. You don't do that. just like rude. And they get into arguments and I have anxiety. And I'm like, guys, stop. Guys, stop. Guys, stop. Please. Puppy just shot out of my mouth. Good thing you were all white. I know I look like an angel. Put a hand over <laughs> my head. That would make, dude, is there just like random clouds? Am I nuts? That just stopped. Um. It's only raining 10 feet back, but not right here. That's, Nimbus clouds. From what? Nimbus clouds, isn't that a thing? Nimbus or the, no, or is it Plumbus? That's definitely not. <laughs> You're like, or is it Christopher Columbus? <laughs> There's like one singular rain cloud that's following me around. 
I feel like I'm being watched. That's how I feel every day of my life with my mental health. It's the government. Yeah. Well. No, that is how it feels though. Maybe I shouldn't say that. I'm gonna get thrown in therapy. My therapist is in the hospital. Oh, for mental health? What do you do in that app? Do they have like a sub? Like a fill-in ther therapist? No, you just don't have therapy. Oh, I oh. I feel like they could be. somebody else and make them be my therapist for the day. I was trying to break this down on one of the podcast episodes. I was like trying to explain how I enjoy lying to people about what I had for breakfast, but that doesn't make me a pathological liar. I just think oh, it's- Oh, I love lying. I'm when not I crazy. When I go out, I literally, if I meet somebody new, will tell them I'm divorced. It's, yes. I have tell people that I've broken like, at least half of my bones. If you see me in a bar bathroom, I will literally put on a show and be like, <sighs> and they're like, what's up? What's wrong? Like, are you okay, girl? And I'm like, my ex-husband's here. Like, I'm just a fucking liar. It's fun. You get it. If you're meeting a stranger, you have absolutely no obligation to tell the truth to them. The world is your stage. Exactly. Make shit up. That's what I was trying to get across. Sorry, the camera died, but what we were what I was saying beforehand was... Yes, me if I think Channing Tatum is hot. And you said absolutely. 100%. But very Cute. drawn back, of course, because you have a boyfriend. He's not about hotter it. than my boyfriend. No, that's not what we said at all. But anyways, I see people on the internet being like, Oh, here comes mid Tatum with another movie. I go, hold on a minute, that, that man is gorgeous. I don't want to hear it. Are talking about his movies, though, you think? No, 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 no. No one's no. calling Channing Tatum's physical appearance mid. I promise you, they were like, Oh, I don't understand why anybody could find him attractive. And I was thrown back. Magic Mike? I was hurled. And like, look, I'm not saying anything, but sometimes I get a little upset for Channing and I look at the people's profile and I go, let's calm down. Yeah. I go, let's calm down. 100%. Don't throw stones in a glass house. Oh, let's. that's a <laughs> I saw a sign that said like Morgan Wallen playing at one of the bars there. Legit, we're just talking about Ox. Imagine like, they just start doing that every weekend. They're like, Drake, this weekend. <laughs> you just walk in, it's just some kid with his phone out. When's Drake showing up? He already, already showed up, man. Do you not have ears, bro? Drake's here right now. I've been really listening to that. Yeet recently. Can't understand a word what he's saying. You say? Yeet, that's the guy's name. Some that's his birth name? songs blow up. Yeah, that's his birth name. I don't know, what's it short for? Yeeticus. That's a cool name. Yeeticus Swag is his name, I'm pretty sure. Actually? Somebody? What? Actually? No, it's not. Oh. No. Anyways, guys, see you next time. That's peace. it? That's all you do now? What yeah. the fuck happened to the outro? The outro's just like too much and I don't like it. You don't do the peace out thing anymore? It's too much. Peace out!